Good afternoon, Sharon. Congratulations on being the first elected BNP County Councillor. Not only are you a County Councillor, but you're also a Borough Councillor. Today is the first meeting of the full council at County Old Preston. Can you tell me how different it's been for you today? It's been very different actually because as you can see County Hall behind me is a very large building. It covers many more services than we do at the borough. The advantages of this is that we are able to get more information to better represent the people who elected us into these positions. I noticed in the meeting today that you were seated at the back on your own. Do you think this was done to intimidate you? Perhaps it was, but uh, believe you me, it does not intimidate me. In fact, I quite like it. I can, uh, from the back, I can see how all the other parties are voting. And I think it just shows that those that have decided that I sit there at the back are unable to accept the democratic process. It is them that are prejudiced against the British National Party, not the British National Party who are prejudiced against others. I believe that the county councillors, the Liberal Democrat county councillors, made a comment on local radio before the, the meeting. Oh, they, they did indeed, yes, and they were probably responsible for trying to put me out of the way. Yes, Charles Briggs, the Liberal from Burnley, said that he would not work with the British National Party. Well, I have a message for Charles Briggs from Burnley of the Liberal Party. If you are, are unable to accept the democratic process in which we have all been elected, I suggest you stand down now. How has it been from the British National Party? Did they send any support along to help you out on your first day? They did indeed, yeah, and I am truly grateful. The support was fantastic, yes. I'm really grateful uh, we had security. We had our own security. But I would also like to thank the security from Lancashire County Council and the staff that have been involved in this for keeping me safe. So, so is it a myth that the council staff and the council people, their security and that wasn't going to help you? You were supposed to be blacklisting when it started. How, how do you think about that? Are you, uh, have you been getting a good response from the staff? No, I've got an excellent response from the staff. They say that my safety is important to them and it's their duty and they have done that and for that I'm truly grateful. Thank you very much.